The F-15 Eagle is a formidable fighter aircraft that was developed in response to the lessons learned from the Vietnam War. During the conflict, the U.S. Air Force faced significant challenges as their fighter pilots were being outmatched by smaller and more maneuverable enemy aircraft such as the Soviet Union's MiG-21. One of the key issues highlighted during the Vietnam War was the lack of effective close-range air combat capabilities in American fighters. The prevailing belief at the time was that air-to-air -air missiles had made dogfighting obsolete, leading to the omission of guns in aircraft like the F-4 Phantom. However, the Vietnam War demonstrated the continued relevance of close-range engagements, where the lack of maneuverability and guns put American pilots at a disadvantage. This realization prompted the need for a dedicated air superiority fighter that could excel in both long-range and close-range combat scenarios. In response to this requirement, the U.S. Air Force initiated the Fighter Experimental FX, program in 1966 to develop a fighter aircraft capable of dogfighting with the latest Soviet fighters, including the formidable MiG-25. The program aimed to create an aircraft with exceptional speed, maneuverability, and advanced technology for detecting and engaging enemy aircraft before entering a dogfight. Several companies, including McDonnell Douglas, North American Rockwell, and Fairchild Republic, submitted proposals for the FX program. Additionally, in an unexpected move, the Defense Department requested NASA to provide its own proposal. NASA's involvement was driven by their expertise in cutting-edge technology and problem-solving capabilities. Through extensive research, including the study of variable sweep wing configurations, NASA's findings influenced the design of not only the McDonnell Douglas F-15, but also the Grumman F-14 Tomcat. Ultimately, McDonnell Douglas was awarded the contract to build the F-15 in 1969. The design of the F-15 incorporated some of the design cues borrowed from NASA, resulting in a fighter aircraft with distinctive features. The aircraft featured fixed wings and a wide fuselage, which could also serve as a lifting surface. These design elements contributed to the F-15's exceptional maneuverability and stability. The F-15 Eagle entered production, with 107 jets being initially built for testing and further development. The first prototypes took to the sky in 1972. The F-15's design has remained remarkably consistent over the years, with its capabilities still highly regarded in modern times. The F-15's power is derived from its two Pratt and Whitney F-100 PW100 afterburning turbofan engines, which provide an impressive 23,500 pounds of thrust with afterburners engaged. The engines are equipped with a digital electronic engine control system, allowing for rapid acceleration from idle power to maximum afterburner in just a few seconds. This power allows the F-15 to reach speeds of up to Mach 2.5, making it one of the fastest fighter aircraft of its generation. Its advanced and slash APG-63 nose-mounted radar system enables the detection of low-flying enemy aircraft at a range of up to 200 miles. Notably, the F-15's radar system was the first to utilize a programmable system processor, allowing for software updates and improvements without requiring hardware changes a concept that has become integral to modern fighter aircraft like the F-35. Beyond speed and firepower, the F-15 was purpose-built for long-haul missions. It can carry three 600-pound external fuel tanks, providing it with a range of 3,000 miles without the need for aerial refueling. This remarkable range, combined with its ability to cruise at high speeds without afterburners, allows the F-15 to undertake extended missions and be deployed rapidly across the world. The F-15 Eagle is a highly capable air superiority fighter aircraft that possesses a range of features that contribute to its exceptional performance and combat capabilities. Its design emphasizes maneuverability, acceleration, range, avionics, and weaponry to ensure it can outperform and outfight any current enemy aircraft. One of the notable strengths of the F-15 is its maneuverability, which is achieved through a combination of high engine thrust-to-weight ratio and low wing loading. The high thrust-to-weight ratio allows the aircraft to generate significant power, enabling it to perform tight turns without losing airspeed. The low wing loading, which is the ratio of aircraft weight to its wing area, further enhances maneuverability by reducing the load on the wings. The F-15's avionics system is multi-mission oriented, setting it apart from other fighter aircraft. 
It includes a range of advanced technologies such as a head-up display, an advanced radar system, inertial navigation, tactical communication systems, and instrument landing capabilities. These systems provide the pilot with essential flight information and enable the detection, acquisition, tracking, and engagement of enemy aircraft, even in challenging weather conditions. The radar system of the F-15 is a versatile pulse Doppler radar that can detect and track aircraft at various altitudes and ranges, including both high-flying and low-flying targets. It has the ability to differentiate between airborne targets and ground clutter, allowing it to maintain accurate situational awareness. The radar feeds target information into the aircraft's central computer, facilitating effective weapons delivery. Additionally, the F-15 is equipped with an electronic warfare system for threat warning and countermeasures against selected threats. The F-15 is armed with a wide range of air-to-air -air weaponry, making it highly capable in aerial combat. It can carry a combination of air-to-air -air missiles, including infrared-guided Sidewinder missiles, radar-guided Sparrow missiles, and medium-range AMRAM missiles. These missiles provide the F-15 with the capability to engage and destroy enemy aircraft at various ranges. Furthermore, the aircraft is equipped with an internal 20mm Gatling gun, located in the right-wing route, which can fire a high rate of rounds per minute. In addition to its air-to-air -air capabilities, the F-15E Strike Eagle variant is a two-seat, dual-role aircraft designed for all-weather, air-to-air, and deep interdiction missions. It features an upgraded rear cockpit with multiple displays for enhanced aircraft systems and weapons management. The F-15E is equipped with a flight control system that allows for terrain following and hands-off navigation, even at low altitudes and high speeds. The F-15E's payload capacity is impressive, with the ability to carry up to 23,000 pounds of ordnance. It can be armed with a variety of air-to-ground weapons, including guided bombs such as the GBU-10, GBU-12, GBU-15, and GBU-24, as well as the AGM-65 Maverick infrared-guided missile. The F-15E was the first aircraft to be armed with the GPS-guided GBU-39 small-diameter bomb, which offers high precision and can be carried in large quantities. To enhance targeting capabilities, the F-15E is equipped with the Lantern, Low Altitude Navigation and Targeting Infrared for Night system. This system includes a forward-looking infrared sensor, which provides video images projected onto the pilot's heads-up display, and a terrain-following radar. The F-15E can designate targets using radar images, and the data is transferred to the Lantern system for tracking and guidance of air-to-ground weapons. The F-15E is equipped with a comprehensive suite of electronic warfare systems, including radar warning receivers, radar jammers, and electronic countermeasures. These systems provide threat warning and automatic countermeasures against selected threats, enhancing the survivability of the aircraft during combat operations. The F-15 has undergone several variants and developments over the years. The initial F-15A model made its first flight in July 1972, followed by the two-seat F-15B trainer in July 1973. The F-15B was delivered in November 1974, and in January 1976, the first F-15 for combat squadron use was delivered. Subsequently, the single-seat F-15C and two-seat F-15D models were introduced in 1979. These models featured the production Eagle package, PEP 2000 improvements, including additional internal fuel capacity, provision for external conformal fuel tanks, and increased maximum takeoff weight. In 1983, the F-15 Multistage Improvement Program, MSIP, was initiated, resulting in the production of the upgraded F-15C model in 1985. The MSIP brought several enhancements, such as an upgraded central computer, a programmable armament control set for advanced versions of air-to-air -air missiles, and an expanded tactical electronic warfare system. The MSIP also introduced the Hughes APG-70 radar in the final 43 aircraft produced. During Operation Desert Storm in 1991, F-15C and F-15E models were deployed to the Persian Gulf and showcased their superior combat capabilities. The F-15C fighters accounted for 34 of the 37 Air Force air-to-air -air victories during the operation, 
while the F-15 E-Strike Eagles primarily conducted night operations, targeting Scud missile launchers and artillery sites using the Lantern system. The F-15 E-Strike Eagle, introduced in 1986, is a two-seat, dual-role fighter designed for all-weather, air-to-air, and deep interdiction missions. It can carry air-to-air -air missiles for beyond visual range engagements, and has air-to-ground capabilities to penetrate hostile air defenses and deliver precision ordnance weighing up to 24,000 pounds. Over the years, the F-15E has undergone various upgrades and improvements. Boeing has focused on upgrading the programmable armament control set and software to enable the delivery of precision weapons such as the Joint Direct Attack Munition, Joint Standoff Weapon, and Wind Corrected Munition Dispenser. The aircraft's night vision capabilities have been enhanced, and new active matrix liquid crystal displays have been installed. The F-15E has been extensively deployed in various military operations, including air expeditionary force deployments, operations in no-fly zones, and combat operations in Afghanistan and Iraq. Boeing introduced the F-15 Silent Eagle, F-15SE, in 2009. It features a modular design approach with aerodynamic, avionic, and stealth enhancements. Aerodynamic changes improve efficiency and fighter performance, while reductions in radar cross-section enhance frontal aspect stealth capability. The F-15 SE includes internal weapons bays for reduced radar signature, and its avionics suite comprises an integrated AESA radar and a digital electronic warfare system. Overall, the F-15 has proven to be an exceptional fighter aircraft with a remarkable combat record. Its continuous evolution and development have allowed it to remain highly capable and adaptable to meet the changing demands of modern warfare. More than 1,500 F-15s are currently in service worldwide, highlighting the enduring success and significance of this renowned aircraft.